everybody. So I just wanted to describe how we lit our fire and melted our aluminum for casting into this anthill. We made an earth oven by digging a hole in the ground larger than the crucible we were using and also another hole coming from a 45 degree angle down to the bottom of the hole so we could force air in. Then put some coal in the bottom, lit it on fire, put in our crucible and filled the rest of the cavity with coal and then pushed air into the fire with our shop back so it was blowing air in on the coal and burning it that way. We melted about 14 pounds of aluminum or at least that's how much the anthill casting weighs after we got it all washed out. So it was a neat experience ways but it seemed to work okay. So that's how we melted the aluminum. The aluminum that we poured in here was about I think the final casting weighs about 14 pounds. So when the aluminum was all melted then I fished it out and we poured it into the anthill. It looked like there were actually no ants in the anthill for some reason it had been abandoned. It, we didn't see any live action anyway. But unfortunately we never had enough metal and it poured down right into the anthill. It probably would have been another 10 inches or a foot more if we'd had another probably twice as much metal. And then uh, the next struggle, after having it all cooled down, the next struggle was trying to get it out of there because it's fragile enough that if you try to excavate it completely while in there it will break itself apart because of the weight of the mud around it. It's all clay. And it was a, such a large clay ball uh, it was just so heavy it was almost impossible to move. When we finally used a pressure washer to get most of the mud out of it, lift it out and then pressure washed the rest of the way at home just to get it so we could uh, manage it. Anyway, it looked great. I think it worked out really well. We'll be doing it again for sure. It's just one of those things that why would you only do it once? But I thought it was a lot of fun. The kids enjoyed it. It looks really cool. It just looks to me like a piece of uh, coral almost from underneath the ocean. But I think it was a fun project, that's for sure. So that is how we made our first molten aluminum anthill casting. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.